traditional method of learning Qigong is from a master, a teacher who has the experience to impart the subtleties of their unique system. One of these great elder masters is Duan Zhu Liang. He has lived most of his 90 years in Beijing. His teacher in keeping with tradition was his grandfather. His father was a guard at the Forbidden City as was his grandfather and great-grandfather. While they protected the last emperor, Yang Duan played in the courtyard and learned the ways of a warrior. The Duan family holds a lineage for the Wu Ji style of Qigong, which dates back to the 8th century, as noted in this ancient tablet, located in Xi'an. The tablet, known as Da Qin Jingjiao, was discovered along the Silk Road and records the interactions between the Chinese and Christians traveling from the West. Master Duan, like his family, is a devout Catholic, and his unique form of Qigong encompasses the Taoist and Buddhist beliefs, as well as Christian principles. Although Qigong is not a religion and requires no change in a belief system, the balance and peace one feels after doing these exercises will extend to all aspects of one's life. Master Duan, who has been studying Wu Ji Qigong in martial arts since he was seven years old, is a doctor of traditional Chinese medicine who is renowned for his compassion and generosity. He typically charges ten yuan, which is about one U.S. dollar for a Qigong treatment. Master Duan incorporates acupuncture, oxybustion, followed by a strenuous Kung Fu workout, where this 90-year-old master routinely spars with other masters and students one-third his age. Master Duan's Wu Ji Qigong is an easy-to-learn system that is comprised of 18 individual forms. Each form is designed to energize different internal organs and promote qi energy flow throughout the body. Wu Ji Qigong has its roots in sword fighting, the Duan family specialty. Most of the moves are focused on loosening up and strengthening the shoulders, neck, and wrists, keys to winning in battle, and coincidentally, key trouble spots for modern-day computer users. Curiously, Master Duan believes one cannot be a good fighter without being a good healer. On the battlefield, a warrior must be adept at tending to his own wounds and those of his fellow soldiers. The powerful techniques of Qigong were thus coveted as secret knowledge, since holding this information meant having the competitive edge. <laughs>